something that's never been seen before on Earth. It looks like a rock, but when you look at it closely, the lines on it look like dragon scales. Who would have believed there were dragons on Earth? But scientists brought it back to the lab and found, this thing can't be the scales of any creature on Earth. The only explanation is the dragons written in the books. It was just a guess, but a few days later, at a zoo, a security guard was out on patrol. He accidentally witnessed something. It was hundreds of meters long, and then he swallowed a three-ton elephant alive in his mouth. The security officers was able to run for his life. There was a huge outcry in the area, but a few days later, the police were called to another house. Someone also claimed to have seen a giant animal enter their home. It could have eaten a man with a single mouthful. Those who saw it said it resembled a snake. Its bloody mouth was two meters wide. Anyone who saw it would be dead. Soon rumors of this monster spread throughout the city. People began to fear that the beast might attack them at any moment. Some wanted to ask the police to catch the monster. But the police didn't care much when they learned about it because they thought it would soon leave the city. But they never expected. A few days later, the police were called again. The monster came near a hospital. After looking around the hospital, it rushed into the hospital with a bloody mouth. The people in the hospital were so scared that they ran away. In a matter of minutes, the hospital was completely destroyed. A few people in the basement were about to get into their cars when they saw what was behind them. They were so scared that they drove their cars to the outside. But the beast had also spotted them. Both of them started chasing each other through the basement. Although the beast is huge, it moves surprisingly fast. It slithers through the underground garage like a snake. Its body hits the building without a scratch until the beast reaches the street. That's when people see what it really looks like. It's a giant king cobra. The king cobra chased it all the way to the street. It destroyed all the buildings on the street. When it roared, everyone runs away in fear. A car was just passing by when it took a bite out of his mouth. You can imagine the size of his mouth. The car was smashed several hundred meters away. The people inside died instantly. That's when the police realized the danger of the monster. They sent police cars to the scene. The police shot at the king snake, but the police's guns had no effect on the king snake. The king snake begins to crawl towards the building. The coiled body gradually came to the very top of the building. The two men saw the king snake catching up with them, so they took the helicopter on the top floor to escape. But the moment they took off, the snake bites into the airplane. The helicopter began to shake. They had to jump out of the helicopter again. The king snake quickly destroyed the helicopter on the ground. There was no escape now. The king of the snakes just watched them. Then the army helicopters arrived. Four military helicopters bombarded the snake king. The king snake feels threatened by the helicopters. He tries to bite the helicopters, but they're too agile. The king can't bite them until the helicopters fire military missiles. That's when the king snake was really knocked out. The giant king snake falls from a tall building and hits the ground hard. The king wasn't dead. He screamed. Countless pterodactyls flew in from far away. People didn't know where these creatures were coming from. They just started destroying the city. The helicopters were destroyed by the pterodactyls within minutes. Humans feel threatened like never before. They have no choice but to call for help. After the rescue, the army's tanks and soldiers are all here. They fight these monsters to the death. Although human weapons are more advanced. But the strange thing is that the pterodactyls can shoot fireballs out of their mouths. 